Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I decided to do this forest green look for you. I haven't done a green look in a while, so I literally sometimes just go through the rainbow and I'm like red, orange, yellow, green. Okay, green, yeah, that looks good. So anyway, if you guys wanna see how to create this green smoky eye, please keep watching. So as always, I'm gonna start by priming my eyelids and I'm gonna be going in with Motives Cosmetics Eye Base. Just gonna grab a little bit of that on my finger and blend it onto my eyelid. I'm gonna set this using Huda Beauty's Easy Bake Loose Setting Powder in Banana Bread. And I'm gonna set it using Morphe by Jaclyn Hill's JH30 brush. So now for my eyeshadow today, I'm going to be going in with Motives Cosmetics Dynasty Palette. And for my transition shade, I'm going to be going in with Venus. I'm going to blend that in using my Anastasia Beverly Hills A12 brush. And really getting that in my outer V. So I'm going to blend it on the outer half of my lid. And bringing it up close to the brow bone. I'm gonna bring this color in a little bit, but mainly focusing it on the outer half and just blending it in just so there's no line right in the middle here. So the next color I'm gonna use to deepen up my outer V is Nephrodite. And I'll be applying this with my Morphe by Jaclyn Hill JH37 brush. So I'm just going to pick that up just like I did the yellow and do the same thing. But this time I'm not going to bring it in to the inner half of my crease. Just going to keep it on the outer half. Make sure to go back in with that Venus and blend this all out. And then keep alternating until you get it how dark you want it. And if you need to, go ahead in with a smaller brush and this is my Morphe S20 pencil brush. And I'm just gonna keep picking up Venus, the yellow color and really blending out that edge beside the brown. Sometimes you just need a smaller brush to really get in there. And now for my lid, I'm gonna be going in with Luna. I'm just gonna take that on my Anastasia Beverly Hills A3 smudger brush. Pick up some of that green. And just blend it onto my lid. And then taking a smaller crease brush, this is Morphe S12. And blending out that green with Venus as well. And then on top of this, I'm gonna go in with Cleopatra, just to give it more of like a mossy green color. And then going back in with that dark brown. Now for my under eye, I'm gonna go back in with that brown on my Morphe S20 brush. And blend that in under my lash line. Just halfway. 
then brushing that brush off on a towel or a paper towel, picking up some of that Venus, and blending that brown out. Then taking that smudger brush and a little bit of Luna, the green. Smudging that on the inside here. And a little bit of the blue, Cleopatra. And then taking Venus again and just blending that out. So I lied, this green one has been, is called Athena. I just got the, the shadows mixed up, whoops. Because I'm gonna be going in with Luna now on my inner corner. And I'm gonna go in with my Sigma E45 inner corner shader brush. Uh, that's done. I'm gonna go in with some lashes and I'm gonna be going in with motives number 112. I'm just gonna run a spoolie through my lashes just so I can blend my natural ones with these false ones. And I'm gonna go into Medusa, this black shadow here. I'm really just gonna use a liner brush. This is my Morphe B21 brush. And just cover up any glue that might be exposed. Then for mascara, I'm going to be going in with Buxom's Blackest Black Mascara. Now I'm just going to go in and contour my face using Bare Minerals Tan to Dark Contour Face Shaping Powder Trio. And I'm going to go in with Shade and Blend Mixed. I'm going to take this on my big Morphe RO brush. I don't know if that just cut off there, so anyway, I just contoured my nose, so I'm just going to take this little fluffy powder brush and just blend those lines out. So next for blush, I'm going to be going in with Morphe's 8W Warm Master Blush Palette. And I'm going to be going in with MUA using my Anastasia Beverly Hills A19 brush. So next for highlight, I'm going to be going in with Natasha Denona's Super Glow. And this is an 03 bronze. And I'm going to also use this on my nose. And my Cupid's bow. Then using my same E46 brush, I'm just going to pop this on my brow bone. And then lastly for lips, I'm going to be going in with Smashbox Always On Liquid Lipstick in Slay Tan. It's just a brownie nude. And this is the final look. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and supporting my channel. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos. Also, if you guys want to be notified when I post a new video, go ahead and click that bell icon below this video. I hope you enjoyed this look and it inspires you to create looks similar to this or even this one. Thank you guys for your support. I love you so much and hopefully I'll see you in my next video.